Welcome to From Kitchen to Table, a behind the scenes cooking show starring your favorite local restaurants. I'm your host, Liana Venturello. Today we're at Arturo's Tavern in Maypack, New York, sitting at their famous martini bar. Soon the place will be bustling with the sounds of happy customers and friends as they enjoy one of the martini specials of the day. Arturo's is known for its welcoming family atmosphere, soft lighting, and generous portions. Arturo's has been serving the community for over 15 years. They must be doing something right. In the kitchen, Chef Tommy and his crew work hard and fast to prepare all of their delicious meals, while their Turbo staff happily waits with hungry customers. Chef Tommy Isidori is preparing one of our Turbo's favorite soups, pasta pizzoli. Let's go into the kitchen and see what's cooking. Hi, Chef Tommy. Hi, how are you doing? How are you? Very good. Good. So we're making pasta pizzoli. Today we're making a pasta pizzoli. Great. Uh, I'm going to start by chopping our medium-sized onion. Okay. Usually if you take about a quarter of a pound of bacon, I finally chopped that. Huh? If I want oil, this should be enough. And how long does it have to cook for? I render this down for about seven to ten minutes so mm -hmm. the onion gets nice and the bacon is a little crisper. Okay. It's a little salt. So what kind of pasta are we using? I use an orichetta pasta for my pasta for show. Mm -hmm. It's called the ear of the pasta. It's an Italian word for the ear. And it's, it's called orichetta. They're little baby shells. Of course. That smells so fantastic already. And now I'll add my beans in. Mm -hmm. At the same time, mm -hmm. I'm trying to crush the beans a little bit. Not all of them, just some of them. You want them tender? Right. Mm -hmm. I'm to take my fresh chicken stock. I think it's that bacon I'm smelling. It's yeah. Smells so good. Back on the fire. Mm -hmm. And you let it simmer until the beans are nice and tender. I take my orichetta, mm -hmm. it's simmering. I put a little orichetta inside. Okay. Let that simmer. And let the orichetta get nice and hot. Just put it right in like this. That looks delicious. A little fresh parsley. Huh? A little more cheese on top. Some more cheese. That looks nice great. So definitely try this at home. So should we go try this now? Why not? Okay. Can't wait. Let's go. So I'm here with Chef Tommy and Carmelo, the owner, who's making me a peach mango martini. So tell me, Arturo's is known for the martini bar. Yes. So how did that come about? Well, we started making these uh, fresh fruit infused martinis. Mm -hmm. And we started off with one, and now every week we do three different fruits. And we also have a big martini menu with over a dozen to choose from. Wow. This is a peach mango. Wow. Okay. That sounds great. That looks beautiful. Yeah. Lovely. Okay, so I can't wait to try this pasta pajol. Yes, try it. Mm, that is so flavorful. So come to Arturo's and try this pasta pajol straight from Chef Tommy's kitchen to your table, or try to make it at home. 